Well, not a whole lot to say. We got beat by a better football team. So it's disappointing, with especially the way we started the game. We'll give them credit. They got a good team in all three phases. We got whipped. So on the road recruiting tomorrow, that's the way we'll change our program. And that's what we need to do to go recruit. Questions? What do uh, what do you do with your senior guys? Do your guys do you still have another game to play after going through a night like this? Yeah, we'll, we'll get ready for bowl practice. Will well, any problem with the way the game ended? With back to back timeouts, any of that stuff? It is what it is. Well, we had some opportunities of being in position. You got to make some plays. Go back and study what we did. And see if we can't do better. Is Jake 100% healthy? He's fine. There's no structural damage. He had, he had a hard time pushing off of it. He, uh, you know, coming out of halftime, I did not feel good. He wanted to go. I did not feel good about putting him back in the game. There's nothing. You know, he just didn't. He didn't feel good that he could push off of it. And uh, I did not feel good putting him back in the game. Neat. Yeah. He's fine. Though. There's no structural. There's no issues. I just, I didn't think that. Uh, I didn't feel good about putting him back in the game. What did you think of his play? Fine. Why, why did you guys have him come over to the for plays? Well, we were we wanted to slow the pace down a little bit um, early in the game and try and limit their snaps as much as possible. Create something, make something happen. We weren't getting anything going offensively. Defense, we were having a hard time. We're trying to steal a possession. Well, did it snowball as far as offensively and, and trying to get things going? Nothing working? Uh, wasn't a whole lot working on the offense, defense, either one. So if you take your bet, you could lead by a better team this year. What was the game plan with, with Mike Williams? Well, we rolled up on him several times. I mean, we, you, you, in order to stop the run, which we needed, we've always got to have an extra hat in the run right now. And so you're going to create some one-on-ones. He had some one-on-ones. He made some plays. He's a really good player. So I mean, you give him credit. We got a very good quarterback. Deshaun's a very good player. Made some nice balls down the field. We were in some one-on-one. We rolled up. We played zone. We, so we, we did multiple things. Obviously, not very effective. Can you proceed through recruiting, getting your talent level? Before it comes to this? That'll be all right. 14 first half carries. Was that a function of you saw some things in the past game, or they got out and scored quickly, and you felt like you had to keep up? No, I think that there were some times that we just felt like that. You know, they were playing, they were trying to outnumber us in the box. We had some one-on-one -on -one matchups outside, and we were trying to take some shots, and we tried to stretch the field vertically. But we didn't have a lot of, you know, a lot of. Uh, Success. So, just disappointing. I've heard it both ways from head coaches. Some just say flush losses like these. Do you want your guys to remember? Or do you want them just to get rid of this and just move on? No, we'll sit on this for a while. What did you think of the way Brandon came on the second? Half? I thought he did a really nice job when he came in the game. But Brandon's practiced extremely well. Um, you know, he's handled his situation extremely well as far as practicing and approaching things the right way mentally. So, uh, you know, he's done a nice job. Brandon's a good football player. You look at him more for bowl practice. Sure. When will you start bowl practice if you decide it? Yeah. What's that? When will you start bowl no, practice? No, it'll all be depending on the game and win and all the, those sort of things. What was Clemson's front seven doing that was kind of disruptive? The I remember they got good players up front. They've recruited extremely well. Were they doing anything after? No, they're just doing really good. They got good players. Talk about rivalry games, what this means to you know both teams and rivals and things of that nature. Did, did that play a factor in your preparation of this at all? No. Well, our guys need a little time off. We'll get two lifts next week, and then we start exams. We won't have anything football-wise as far as that's concerned. Determine when we start bowl practice based on when we play the game. I mean, we'll have a team meeting tomorrow. So, I mean, we'll go through some things that we need to do as 
as far as those things, the coaches would be going to recruit. How much do you rely on coaches? Talking, that? How much do you rely on coaches talking to players and seniors kind of stepping up and leading the team after a loss like this? We'll handle. What was the message to your guys at halftime? Did you feel like they were still engaged? What's that? What was the message to your players at halftime? Did you feel like they were still engaged? I thought we gave effort in the second half. You know, you're down 35 nothing. It is what it is. Anything else, Coach? If you came out throwing first four plays, I mean, was that the offensive approach was coming from? 